Welcome back to SourceFed, I'm Steve Zaragoza. Joseph Fiennes, the star of such films as Shakespeare in Love, Elizabeth, and was in season two of American Horror Story, is now gonna play Michael Jackson in a TV movie about a supposed real road trip that Jackson, Elizabeth Taylor, and Marlon Brando took after 9-11 from New York City to Los Angeles. Yeah, uh, this is real. This isn't a joke. Those three superstars actually drove a car themselves. Just kidding, that's not the real. Shocking part. It, the shocking part is a white guy is gonna play Michael Jackson and people aren't happy about it. The BET Twitter account tweeted out, a white actor will play MJ because we aren't whitewashed enough in Hollywood apparently. Actor Orlando Jones tweeted, I'm totally on board with Joseph Fiennes playing Michael Jackson if and only if Angela Bassett is cast as Elizabeth Taylor. Now it's kind of bad timing what with all the controversy over the hashtag Oscars so white debacle. The production is from the UK based Sky Arts and was written by Neil Forsyth who says it's done and will be released in the UK Soon. The TV movie is based on apparent actual events that occurred in 2001 that was written about in a Vanity Fair article called Liz Taylor, Michael Jackson, and Marlon Brando star in Escape from New York, where the trio took a road trip to Los Angeles from New York following the terrorist attacks on 9-11. Now, Grease star Stockard Channing is playing Elizabeth Taylor, and Brian Cox is playing Marlon Brando. The movie is called Elizabeth, Michael, and Marlon. Now, despite the casting controversy, this concept is way too good to be wasted on a dumb drama. This needs to be an insane road trip comedy with Seth Rogen and James Franco involved? F I'm gonna write it. It's way too good of a concept to not be a hilarious adventure comedy. I want Muppets in it. In sad news, the principal of an Indiana elementary school died after pushing children out of the way of a moving bus. The incident occurred on Tuesday when Principal Susan Jordan was helping load kids into cars for rides home when one of the buses suddenly jumped the curb. The bus driver told firefighters she's not sure why the bus lurched forward, but she saw Jordan push several students out of the way. The students she saved, both 10, were taken to a hospital with serious but not life-threatening injuries. The community absolutely loves Susan and it shows in many ways, as last year the students and faculty got together and made a video for the principal expressing just how much they all cared for her. Now, she spent more than two decades at Amy Beverly Elementary School and was beloved by the community as well. The Metropolitan School District of Lawrence Township announced on Twitter that classes would be canceled today as they mourn the loss of Jordan. Now, the school board released a statement that said, Susan was an amazing educator. She had a remarkable way of making everyone she came in contact with feel valued and important. She had a passion for children that is unmatched. The entire Lawrence Township community mourns her loss and extends our sympathy to the Amy Beverly community, the multitudes of people whose lives she's touched. Our thoughts and sympathies go out to the community, friends, and loved ones who were touched by Susan Jordan's kindness and bravery. Rest in peace. So what are your thoughts on Joseph Fiennes playing Michael Jackson, and who's a teacher or principal who affected your life that deserves a shout out just for being awesome? Let us know in the comments down below. I'm Steve Zaragoza. Thanks for watching. We'll call 1-800-Insta-Boyfriend-Trainer. With only three payments in $19.99, we'll teach your boyfriend how to not completely embarrass you in front of everyone. <laughs> my, section, my, my culture's section of the grocery store has cleaning supplies. And, uh, I painted the picture. I think Ricky's noise <laughs> ma like made it all very clear. Was that